welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome to my channel and thank you so much for being here if you are new please consider hitting the subscribe button before you leave and if you're a returning subscriber consider hitting that little bell down below if you haven't already for notifications on when i put up new videos i upload twice a week i've got the whole beachy vibe today because we have been having some pretty extreme hot weather in the next few days i'm gonna be going swimming again for the first time this season and i'm really really excited so i figured why not sit down and do a curvy sense haul? They are an online plus size store offering sizes 1x to 3x and sometimes 4x in select styles. They are really, really affordable, seriously, like great prices. They are very similar, in my opinion, to the likes of like Forever 21, um, H&M, Fashion Nova, same sort of price range. And as per usual, I have partnered with them on this video. But as I always say, and I always do, all of these opinions are going to be of my own. But without further ado, grab a snack, get comfortable, and let's get started. So in usual fashion, I'm going to start with the dress that I'm wearing totally out of my comfort zone, a dress type I've never worn before, but I've seen people wear these. These kind of dresses make me think of somebody going on vacation like a really warm area where there's beaches and you can just lay out in the sun and although this isn't a dress I see myself wearing very often I feel like it's good to have in the wardrobe for those occasions or even like laying out by the pool or you just want to feel like you are a really rich housewife couldn't have a care in the world except who's going to bring you a cup of wine <laughs> I got this in a size 3x and it is super roomy fits me really well there's tons of stretch it's really really flowy and I want to first off apologize for not getting super great footage of this I'm back in the room that doesn't have great angles for filming long pieces so I really apologize you guys got a general idea of what it looks like with this tropical print it's black and white if you like something a little bit more muted which I'm kind of feeling I can do something like this where I wear really like statement earrings and then I feel like it kind of brings the whole look together and since it's black and white I can literally wear any color I want I just don't know how I I feel about this dress on me in general. It's not 100% my style. I'm loving that the front of it has these big slits which means like right now I can air my legs out when it's too hot to keep them covered by fabric and so it's a really really nice feeling to have that option or cover them if it gets a little cold. If you're looking for a really great beachy dress this one's like pretty nice. The fabric is a little bit thicker than I would expect like the only reason I think that's the case is because it does have lining but it's not like unbearably hot. I also need to find the right bra to wear with this but if you guys have suggestions for good strapless bras that would be awesome if you've been following my blog or my Instagram or even this channel you know that I'm like pretty into rompers right now so that's like the first thing that I'm looking for whenever I go on any sort of store website or go into a store in general and I saw this really pretty mauve romper with these long sleeves and even though this is like a long sleeve romper it does have like big cutouts on the arm so it gives you like a little bit more of a breeze it's not like wearing a full sleeve in the middle of the summer also the fabric itself is pretty light and pretty breezy I got this one in a 3x and definitely a really good size however it does fit like on the bigger side so in the case that maybe a 3x was sold out a 2x would totally be okay even in the bottoms because for me when I wear any sort of romper I want it to be roomier in the bottom and like like I said there's like stretch pretty much throughout I've worn this a lot already I wore it to travel home from Boston and it is seriously please stood the test for me I need something really really comfortable and this most certainly was it would sometimes when I wear a romper I don't necessarily love the idea of it because you got to take the whole thing off when you use the washer but to be honest with you this just didn't bother me like at all this one did also come in a few different colors but I'm like super into pink obviously i gravitated towards this color but now that i know that i love it so much there's a very good chance i'm gonna go ahead and get it in the other colors because it's just really nice and feels so good on the body definitely gonna have a lot of fun with it and probably also it's going to be like my main travel outfit so i also picked up this floral kimono or cardigan or I'm not really sure what you want to call it but definitely very very different from anything that I own you can already see if you watch this channel if you know my fashion sense you know these pieces are very like different and unique from the things that I usually haul so I'm gonna have fun with all the like new pieces in my wardrobe with new styles in my wardrobe 
This, if you can't already tell, is see-through. It has floral embroidery all over, and then it's see-through on the areas where there's no embroidery, but it's kind of this like beige fabric, so it does kind of like limit you a little bit with what you can pair it with, but I actually thought it looked pretty all right with the romper that I just showed you. I thought the colors were really nice together, but you could wear it with like a multitude of colors. I mean, even green under this would look really nice. It would add to that like floral look. If you wanted to throw this on over jeans, that would look really nice. And I got this one in a 2X. They didn't have a 3X available anymore, but I knew based off the fact that it's a cardigan or like an overthrow kimono kind of thing, that it would be more than okay. So I knew a 2X would be just fine. I almost wish that I got it in a 3X though, just because I feel like I'd want it to be a little bit longer on me. But I think based off of where the stitching is, it's kind of supposed to hit you like a little bit cropped. But again, this is totally different from anything that I own and I'd probably just need to play around with it a little bit more to figure out how I like to style it myself. The only thing that I'm not super keen on, and this is just my personal preference and like things that irritate me and bother me about clothing, is the fabric is a little bit scratchy. So I don't know if you're finicky like that, but it's not something I can't get over. All right, so I picked up another romper and it's kind of hard to show you because I did have a little bit of a malfunction, but I'll do my best. So it's got this really interesting like lace detail. It's kind of like bohemian in a lot of ways, like around the arm and then it's crochet. I guess crochet is the right word I want to use, not lace. And then it's crocheted on the neckline as well. And it's supposed to be completely sewn up until about like yay on my bust, but as I was putting it on, even though this is a 3X, I felt like it was pretty snug on me and that's because of where it was, I guess, done up on the chest. And then I just heard a lot of ripping and it actually ripped like just around here and then it was still being held together here and I was like you know what I'm just gonna rip it because I feel like it looks kind of weird now even though it's totally exposed and you hear me out here I actually think based off the fact that this is like just a black romper it would look really nice paired with like a really nice bra even the bra that I was wearing with it because it's got color it will look really nice and that's just like kind of another way you could do it or you could put an undershirt I mean really whatever but this is just in the specific case I didn't find that this one fit me like the other 3x it's actually like pretty snug in comparison I feel like because you gotta step into it there's no way around the fact that the chest here is pretty tight and because it's crochet and it's sewn together it's obviously going to be like a little bit delicate so I'm not sure if that was just like a case of this specific piece or if all of them are like that so just be mindful if you go ahead and get this it does also have a back button as well which you can undo but even with it undone and I did undo it um, I still had that issue unfortunately so I don't know I'm still determined to make it work I don't see myself wearing it until like the fall though or when it's a little cooler because it's black it's got long sleeves and even though it's shorts I don't do black in the summer because I'm not looking to boil. Are you even surprised that I have another pink item in here? Because this one immediately screamed my name. It also came in a white, but again, pink. Really, I can't stop myself. And I got this one in a 3X and a few things were a little bit surprising about this. This definitely fits almost like a crop top. Like it hit me, I mean, at my waist, but it's a little bit shorter torso than I was expecting. I kind of wanted to wear this over jeans or something, or if you're not comfortable showing your belly area, this might not be the top for you. Um, it is lined, but only on one side. Front, by the way, so if you're a little concerned about your bra showing, don't worry, like, they have the lining on the front. Um, a little random thing that I like is the button back here is also, like, covered in the same fabric as the shirt. I know that's like another weird thing to like notice. Sometimes you just get a piece of clothing and like the tiniest little things are impressive to you. You know what I mean? I really like this, but I, I just kind of feel a little bit like it's different than I expected in person. And the fact that it's a little bit different than I expected means I can't wear it the way that I had anticipated. But that also opens me up to like a bunch of new ways. I actually really do like the idea of pairing this with shorts and you're seeing it paired with some overalls which I will show you in a second it actually looks like pretty cute like that so as I just mentioned I also picked up a pair of overalls from curvy sense and these are also in a size 3x I was warned before I got these that the shorts are running 
relatively small or smaller than what their sizes say. So I wasn't necessarily super shocked when I put it on my body and it was like a tight fit. Like maybe even a little bit tighter than I could get used to. And I do know that because these are jeans, they're bound to like kind of move out with me. So maybe it would just be a situation of like wearing them around the house or on a really lazy day and just getting them to kind of like move out with my body because they are really cute and I really like them. I've really been wanting a pair of light wash overalls for, I mean, I guess at least a summer now because I do have a pair of like regular wash and I love them so much. They are distressed on the bottom and I am on the fence. I'm not a huge fan of the distressed look. I got it knowing it was so distressed so I can't really say anything about that. And then also the pockets are really long. I guess it's kind of a little bit of a style now to have your pockets like kind of poking out a little bit from your shorts but I like that I can play with the length too and tuck it in because I'm not a huge fan of that look, but I do like the overall look of these overalls. They are pretty stretchy for denim. I did say that these are pretty much a true size 18, pretty much just on the cusp of being able to fit into these. They also do come in a few different washes, by the way, so that is also something to make note of. All right, you guys, that is everything for the haul portion of this video, and I feel like I got some really good pieces. Some of them, to be honest with you, I don't know how much I see myself wearing them, but that's okay because variety is pretty cool too, right? <laughs> Anyways, let me know which of the pieces you guys liked in the comments below, what you think, how you would style a kimono because I am genuinely very, very curious to know how you would do it. And also what you think about this dress on me because maybe I just need somebody to be like, hey, I know it's different, but it looks good on you and wear it. Another huge thanks to Curvy Sense for partnering with me on this video. I love their clothes. They have some great pieces and I am super super happy with almost everything I get from their website. I'm gonna have links to everything I'm wearing in the description below so make sure you check that out before you leave and as per usual don't forget you can find new videos from me every Wednesday and every Sunday and new blog posts every Tuesday and every Thursday and I'll see you next time. Bye!